And now that Governor Ducey has mandated all restaurants switch over to takeout mode or delivery mode, the industry is scrambling to try to find ways to reinvent itself. Team 12's William Pitts talked to some business owners who are changing their business model to try to keep their restaurants afloat. Stuck at home, you're probably not cooking like this. We have uh, euros, we have burgers, of course, we have enchiladas. Um, we basically have 14 different choices that someone can select. But all this can be yours, prepared by experts, ready to eat. Chef Tommy D'Ambrosio co-owns three restaurants and a fleet of food trucks, even won an episode of Chopped. First, Chef Tommy D'Ambrosio. I'm the executive chef and owner of Aeoli Gourmet Burgers and Modern Tortilla in Phoenix, Arizona. So yeah, the guy can probably cook better than you. To make a cow tongue gordita. And right now, his and everyone else's restaurants are trying to find ways to survive. And the big thing is, is being able to adapt. 90% of our events have all been postponed. Uh, everything that we do is a large gathering. Necessity is the mother of invention. So instead of closing, Chef Tommy and his partner Kyle changed their business model. They're still carry out, but now they're offering kits. You can cook an aioli burger at home, or you can order an entire week's worth of food online and have it delivered to your door. That lets a team behind Aeoli Burger keep operating, but also keep their 30 employees paid. And I keep hearing uh, every hour friends, family members that are just getting laid off and furloughed, and we're doing everything in our power to not do that. It's been great. We've uh, we sold about 400 of these uh, of these meals for for the first week. Chef Tommy says with those numbers they can keep going indefinitely, hopefully throughout the shutdown. But this isn't just about restaurant survival. It's about trying to keep any sense of normalcy we can find. Now more than ever, it's all about creating you know, these flavor for meals that give people nourishment, but also a, a little bit of joy in, in their daily life. William Pitts, 12 News. Well, thanks.